I need a little bit more skate support. My name's Jacob. Um, on my ollies, because I know you do a lot of ollie videos. I'm sorry for another one. <laughs> um, I can't seem to get them down. I mean, I've done all of the steps that you said in your ollie tutorial. I've been trying. I've had friends try to teach me. I just can't seem to do it. Um, maybe somebody like you can point things out, like what I'm doing wrong, because none of my friends point anything out, none of, nobody. But I'll give you a couple demonstrations. I know it's crappy outside, but still, get my carport. <laughs> I'll give you a couple demonstrations. Hold up. Any help would be really appreciated. Uh, hopefully you reply to this. Hopefully you upload this, whichever. And it doesn't matter. All right. well, help would be really appreciated, bro. Okay, great. Thanks a lot for sending your video. I really do appreciate it. So on this first ollie, we just have to work on that motion of your front foot sliding up the board a little better. So that's what we got to do there. And on this one, it was a lot better. So let's check this out. Your front foot slides up the board on that one, and you actually level out quite good there. I don't actually see a whole lot of problems with that second ollie. A lot of times I'll get these ollie videos sent in to me talking about how horrible their ollies are or how they can't do it and they just can't work it out. And then they show me them attempting the ollie, and then they ollie. It's kind of like once you're able to get all four wheels off the ground, you can ollie. So that's all there is to it. I mean, there's varying degrees of ollieing height and ollieing with speed and all these different things. But yeah, once you get all four wheels off the ground, you've got it, bud. Cool, so this is what I want you to do. I want you to stand still, and I want you to roll your front foot up the board just like I was doing. I don't show these just because I want to show you how the trick works. I'm actually showing you these steps because I want you to do them to practice. So stand still and just roll your front foot up the board over and over and over and over and over. Let's do it for, uh, let's say, five minutes straight without doing anything else. Time yourself and just stand still on your board and roll your front foot up for about five minutes straight until you really get that motion down. So once you got that motion down, then you can go back to keep continuing to practice the full ollie. It will help you a little bit, I think, if you put your front foot back a little bit more, just because you have more room to slide your front foot up on the board. And really, again, it's that slide of your front foot that's going to pop your board up into the air. So yeah, that's what you need to practice to improve. But like I was saying, your second ollie was good. I mean, your second ollie could take you over a crack, it could take you over a hose, um, could probably take you over a skateboard lying on not the wheel side, but on the grip tape side, if you were able to do it with some speed. So yeah, if I were you, honestly, I would just push around on that board, get outside and push everywhere, and start practicing doing ollies while moving. It's more like you don't need help with your ollies, you need help taking your ollie to the next step doing higher ollies, alling over things, alling up curbs, and things like that. But the more practice you get on just alling while moving, the easier all of the above will become. So yeah, that's my suggestion for you. So practice those tips, and then get your ollies down, and then start doing them downstairs and other things like that once you really have them. Cool, so for any of you guys working on the basics of skateboarding, I highly recommend checking out Skateboarding Made Simple. It breaks down every one of the tricks so that you can practice it without having to attempt the full trick. And it will just help you progress super fast in your skating. So get the video today.